Good morning guys, it's me Sierra. Um, it is Saturday, so that is why I look ridiculously, one, tired, two, not made up and a mess because I work at Starbucks on Saturdays and today was a very crazy Saturday at Starbucks, therefore this is why I look this way. Um, so yeah, that's awesome. Uh, but anyways, I thought I was going to post yesterday, but I didn't film anything, so I'm going to post something today. Um, I think I'm gonna go to the gym. I usually take Saturdays off from working out, but because I'm in the last two weeks of my challenge, I think I'm gonna try to turn it up a notch and maybe throw in a couple little extra workouts here and there. I don't wanna overtrain because that's obviously like really bad and that can store fat because your body would go into shock. Um, but I think the plan will be to do uh, maybe 20, 30 minutes of stairs, which I may or may not film because one, your girl looks terrible when she does stairs, and two, it could be boring, but I could film just like clip. I don't know, y'all will see. And then I think I'm gonna do like a little leg workout um, just in my home gym, and maybe, maybe I won't do any of that, and maybe I will do an at-home workout or like around the house workout that you can do like anywhere you are because that could be helpful. I don't know. Actually, I'm gonna go to the gym. I decided, sorry, at the, my little gym. So like it's not too much equipment, but if you wanna see like an at-home workout or a workout where I'm just doing random stuff like where I find things, then comment below and I'll make that because that could be fun. That could be like, you know, going on an adventure around your apartment complex and you know, doing little workouts and getting outside because it's summertime almost, basically. Okay, yeah, this is a really long intro. I'm really jacked up on caffeine. Um, all I've had today was 10 shots of espresso and I had some oatmeal, some blueberry oatmeal um, with half a packet of brown sugar. That's not super good. Uh, usually I don't do a high carb day on Saturday. Usually I do a high carb day on Sunday. But I'm switching it around because Chris and I are going to the movies tonight and I want to make some homemade popcorn for that. So yeah, that is my long rant of an intro. Um, Teddy just got a bath. Ted, hi, where are you going? Teddy? <laughs> so yeah, um, stay tuned. I will be working out in the next clip. Okay, bye. All right, guys. So for this workout, I'm going to be doing three different supersets, and I'm going to be starting my first superset with curtsy lunges. As you can see, I'm holding dumbbells by my side, and I'm curtsying. Um, so my leg is not going into a straight reverse lunge. It's going a little bit farther into that curtsy motion. Now, if you're new to this move, I would suggest you know, cooling off on the weights or maybe not using weights at all because it is difficult. I am doing three sets of 12 on this superset and so I will do 12 on one leg and then as you just saw, I'm switching legs and doing 12 on this leg before going into the next move in the superset. For my next move in the superset, I'm going to be doing a split squat and I'm going to be doing three sets of 12 reps, 12 to 14 reps again. Um, as you can see, you're basically in a lunged position and you are squatting down as deep as you can without having your knee going over your toe. Mine does a little bit and that's obviously something I need to work on. I need to go a little bit deeper into my leg and push up through my heel. My second superset in this workout is going to start with a goblet squat and I'm going to be doing three sets of 12 to 14 reps. The second move in this superset is going to be a dumbbell deadlift. 
So the most important thing in a deadlift is to keep your back flat, go down slowly, and really squeeze your glutes when you get to the top. And once again, I will be doing three sets of 12 to 14 reps. my third and final superset, I'm going to be starting with a dumbbell hip thrust. And a dumbbell hip thrust is kind of awkward. I really prefer using a barbell, but because this gym only has the dumbbells, I, I it's very effective. It just doesn't feel great on your hips. And same thing, I will be doing three sets of 12 to 14 reps. For the final move of this entire workout and the superset, it's going to be a good morning. And a good morning, you're just holding the dumbbell, you're hinging at your hips, and you're squeezing the glutes really tight at the top. Hey guys, so that was my little leg and booty workout for the day. It wasn't too intense, just three little supersets. Um, but I really like that workout because you can make it as hard or as easy as you want. Like I could have gone up really heavy weight and shortened my rep maybe like to six to eight reps. Or I could have made it, um, I mean not easier, but I could have gone lighter in my weight and then done like 15 to 18 reps, which 18 would be ridiculous and that would suck because curtsy lunges y'all. <laughs> Um, so yeah, I didn't film the little stair stepper because there was like so many people in the apartment gym, which is crazy because it's a Saturday afternoon and it's like 75 degrees, so you'd think everybody would be at the pool. Ew, I'm like so gross and sweaty, guys, like, yuck. Um, Teddy, what you doing? What you doing? Anyways, yes, it was a good workout. Um, please don't mind some of my form, like I filmed that after I was done doing the workout, so, because I don't know what you're supposed to do, or what you're supposed to do, um, I don't know if you're supposed to film before you do the workout, while you're doing the workout, after the workout, so I did after because I really wanted to focus on my workout, um, before filming anything because I didn't want to get distracted because I'm a squirrel, or a dog with a squirrel, I don't know. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna write the entire workout in the down bar, so if you want to check um, out exactly what I did but and the reps and stuff, I mean, obviously I'm gonna explain it in the video, but if you want to write it down and save it for yourself so when you go to the gym, you can do it instead of having to pull up a video, I'm gonna do that for y'all. Um, if you like these types of workouts, I think I can film them once a week, like it's really not that hard and I'm going to hold myself more accountable if I do that. Um, so let me know what you guys want to see in the comments, and yeah, so that was my Saturday workout. I'm in a shower because I'm disgusting, and then I think, um, Christopher wants to go out to dinner, but I don't know if I'm going to go out to dinner because I gotta see where my macros are at for the day. I haven't eaten too much. I definitely want to eat something right now because... I haven't really like talked that much about myself like personally on this channel I don't think like it's been about like my fitness journey or like the things I'm doing in that day but I haven't really talked about who I am as a person so I'm like I love food like I love to eat and I like to reward myself with food which I know is not like the best thing to do but I'm just being honest with you guys like that's what I like I love to eat food um all the time healthy food mostly like I really do crave healthy food um, but you know sometimes I really want other foods like pizza or fries I love fries and nuggets and like all the oh Teddy <laughs> oh Teddy you stopped that um so yeah I'm about two weeks out of my challenge and I don't think I've ever actually shown y'all what my physique is like so this is me after a workout sorry I don't really have like a nice mirror or anything um yeah no abs I have a butt 
tricep. Not really a bicep, I guess. This is my stronger arm. Um, but yeah, that is me. It's me. I really want abs. I know those are made in the kitchen. So, I'm just being real with y'all. What are you doing? <laughs> what you doing? Teddy? <laughs> um, yeah, so like I'm being real with y'all like I don't like I love myself and I love how strong my body is But of course like I'm working to lose more body fat because I think that's most people's goal anyway And it's definitely one of my top goals and I'm being honest with y'all like I do have a decent amount of body fat that I'd like to lose. Um, I'm not sure of the numbers that I'm at right now, but I will know in two weeks when my challenge is over. Um, but obviously, like, I'm going to continue to eat very, not clean, I don't like that. Like, I'm going to eat very balanced, but I'm going to try to eat really whole foods, and I'm still going to track until I've hit more of a maintenance level for my body type, because right now I am in a caloric deficit these are all these things I feel like I should have been talking about for a long time. Um, so I'm sorry if this is like boring or not interesting, but it's just me. Um, <laughs> anyways, I just hope you guys had, uh, I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. I'm tired and I need a shower and I'm disgusting. <sighs> so yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you do enjoy these kind of videos, like you could subscribe because I definitely will be posting more of these. Um, and I hope you guys, if you're on a fitness journey too, like comment below, like we can be accountability partners because that's something that I'm very, I think I believe a lot in is like having somebody that you can text and be like, hey, did you do your workout today? Or like, you know, hey, I really want a pizza. I don't know. I'm just talking now. I feel like I'm being weird. I don't know. I don't even know how to hold my camera. Like, should I have set this up? Like, should I have, like, done something like this? And, like, I don't know. I don't know anything anymore. Anyways, I'm going to sign off because I've rambled for way too long at this point. Um, If I do anything exciting, I might film it, but... Other than that, I think I'm going to do what I eat in a day tomorrow. I'm going to film a high-fat, low-carb day. Um, just because I said I was going to do that last week and I forgot about it this weekend. But I got to think of things that are interesting and not like, you know, avocado. Although I love avocado and I'll probably use it in something. I don't want to just like put avocado on chicken and be like, high protein, high fat, low carb. I'm going to try to be interesting, make something spicy, like, interesting spicy, but also probably spicy spicy. I don't know. Okay, I'm going to leave now. I hope you guys have a magical day. Goodbye.